downloading a font and installing it in InDesign. Here I have dafont.com. Um, if you look at this, that's dafont.com. Okay, this is one of a million different places to get fonts, but it's probably one of the easier ones. So what I'm going to do is quickly go into maybe medieval and download the typical old English style that everybody loves and hates. I hate it, but that's okay. I'm going to download it. And I'm going to save this, and I'm going to put this on my desktop. Okay, I'm going to right-click on it and show in Finder. Incidentally, if you can't get to the downloads palette within Firefox, it's under Tools, Downloads. Okay, So I have this. It is a zip file. I'm double-clicking it. And I should get probably a folder. Sometimes it's not in a folder. Sometimes it's everywhere. But what I'm looking for is the TTF file. I'll double-click TTF. true type font here I'm just gonna say install font the font is called old London okay so now if I go to InDesign and I try that font out first I have to get out of this I can simply make a text box. Go up here, type in old London, and there it is. Okay, so with old London active, I can now go in here and make some letters. And let me make them a little bit bigger here. And you can see, there it is. Old London. Enjoy. That is how to install a font within InDesign. Incidentally, that works on all programs now, and you now have that font in Word, and Photoshop, and InDesign, and Premiere, all of them. So, enjoy.